your body and the body of every other life form on the planet to create energy through metabolic processes. These processes are not perfectly efficient, however, and inevitably some waste is generated. In animals, excess nitrogen is produced as a result of protein metabolism. One role of the kidneys is to process this waste. In other words, convert the toxic nitrogen into forms to be excreted. Ammonia, a nitrogen-containing metabolite, is quite toxic and requires a large amount of water for excretion. Therefore, fish and amphibians with constant access to water can dispose of ammonia directly, but direct ammonia disposal is not seen in terrestrial animals. Mammals, including humans, repackage nitrogenous wastes in the form of urea. Urea is less toxic than ammonia and contains two nitrogen atoms. It also requires less water to flush from the system. All of this comes at the expense of requiring more metabolic energy to produce than ammonia. Birds and reptiles go even further, removing nitrogenous waste in the form of uric acid. It requires even more metabolic energy to produce than urea, but each molecule contains four nitrogen atoms and requires little water to flush. As a bonus, it is quite non-toxic. If you see bird poop, you are actually looking at a mixture of feces and urine. The white part is the urine, uric acid crystals in a minimal amount of water.